Hi everyone, in this tutorial, I'll show you how to create a 3D animated logo in After Effects, quickly and easily, without any third-party plugins. Let's get started. Create a new composition and drag your PNG logo into the timeline. Make sure the image has a transparent background, so the shatter pieces will form only the visible parts of the logo. Right-click the logo layer and choose Pre-Compose. You can name it anything you like, but make sure the box Move All Attributes into the new composition is checked. This keeps the effect clean and lets you replace the logo later if needed. Now open the Effects and Presets panel, search for Shatter, and apply it to the Pre-Comp layer. This effect allows us to break a 2D layer into 3D fragments and control how those fragments behave in space, perfect for creating depth and realistic lighting. In the Effect Controls, Change View, Rendered, so you can see the final shaded result instead of the wireframe. Expand Shape. Pattern, Set Pattern equals Custom, and under Custom Shatter Map, select the pre-composition with your logo. This tells After Effects to use your logo's alpha channel as the pattern that defines where the pieces will appear. Go to Force 1 and set Depth, Radius, and Strength all to zero. This disables the default explosion that Shatter adds automatically, we want the logo to stay intact so we can control its 3D appearance manually later. The Shatter effect has its own built-in 3D camera and lighting system. Open Camera Position and adjust the Y rotation. As you rotate, you'll notice your logo already has real 3D depth. To increase that thickness, raise Extrusion Depth. This extends the sides of each fragment, giving your flat logo a solid 3D body. You'll see that the sides are hollow by default. To fill them, open Textures, Side Mode, and choose Color. Now you can pick any color for the sides. Before choosing the final tone, let's add lighting. Under Lighting, Change Light Type. First, Comp Light, and set Ambient Light around 1. This softens the shadows and adds a gentle base illumination that makes the logo appear more natural and less contrast heavy. Now return to Textures, Side Color. Use the eyedropper to pick the main color from your logo, and then choose a slightly darker shade. That subtle contrast adds depth and realism to the edges. Let's animate the logo rotation. We'll use Camera Position Arrow Y Rotation. At frame 0, set the value to 0 degrees. And at the end of the timeline, set it to 359 degrees. This creates a smooth, full rotation, which loops seamlessly when repeated. Preview the animation. You can see a clean, continuous spin with nice 3D shading. To make it pop, add CC Light Sweep to the logo layer. Set Width equals 100 and Sweep Intensity equals 50. Animate the center property, so the highlight moves diagonally across the logo. For example, from bottom left to top right over one second.
then duplicate and evenly distribute those keyframes across the timeline to keep the glint repeating during the rotation. Select the keyframes. Press F9 to easy ease. Let's preview the final animation. We've created a realistic 3D logo rotation with dynamic lighting and reflections, all using only built-in After Effects tools. Now you can reuse this project as a template. Just replace the image inside the pre-comp with any other logo, scale it, and the animation will automatically update. If you enjoyed this tutorial, give it a like and subscribe for more motion design lessons. And if you'd like to download the full project file and explore other exclusive tutorials, check out my Patreon page. The link is in the description. Thanks for watching and happy animating!